get a tragic here and welcome back to Lord of the Rings. We're going to replay Conflict at the Corrupt. Not because our last quest really went too badly, but there was a bit of a an error with the quest that kind of bugs me. So I want to make sure that I just want to do a, a pure run, so to speak. But I'll, I'll basically, there was an error with how I was using Theodred. So if we just look at Theodred, his effect occurs during the hero committed to quests step, which means that if he's the first player, when he commits to the quest, the second player has not committed yet, which means he can only send resources to the other player every two turns. And I wasn't doing that in the last game. Now, it didn't make a huge difference, but... I just want to play it again and try and get that rule corrected. Now, I'm also going to try and play a much faster game this time. Because last game went ridiculously long. Because we weren't getting... I really wanted to showcase that Thorndor combo. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go a lot quicker and try and get this one, this, this quest done at speed. So I'm not going to read out all the quest things. I've got a full playthrough already up on the channel. So let's check out our mulligan situation here. Let's go hit the mulligan here, blam. We, I always mulligan, so I've hopefully, well, I didn't find any. It's almost the exact same hand. But I like to mulligan to get access to the threat reduction, which we still haven't got. Over here... We do have the support, and we do have Eagles and Mr. Mountain, so this is pretty good, even though we don't have a Descendant, but we do have our Search, so we're going to pass on that one. And this guy is always the first player for me when I start. Okay, let's draw cards and get into it. Your blamo. Okay, we're going to go one, two, place out this guy, and we're going to go boom, boom, boom. Then over here, I'm going to go boom, boom, boom. And I'm also going to cast this bloke. This allows us to search the top five cards of our deck. One, two, three, four, five. And grab any eagles we find. We get a nice, rich vein. Three eagles. Beautiful. Let's return them to the thing and shuffle it. And... We're going to spend one resource, put out an attacker, and then we're going to use Theodred to add a resource to Thalen. We're questing for six. One, two. Wow, negative five. Brown lands, how unlucky. So we go at one threat. We have to travel to the brown lands, and after you travel, it gets a to progress token, so it's instantly discarded. And then we're going to attack into the staging area using Dunn here. He attacks for two. That's all we need to kill this bloke, so he's gone. You blamo. I've got to stop saying the blamo. I'm unable to not say it. <laughs> okay, let's go one, two, three, four place out our Misty Mountains guy, and we can start beefing him up. We've got a lot of cards to buff him with. And we've really got to start looking at our threat reduction very soon. Over this side of the world, we've got some protection. I'm going to go one, two, place out Burning Brand, and we're still going to quest with everybody, I think. And I'm going to use Theodred to add a resource to Thalen. Still plus six. <clears throat> I might uh, untap this guy. We'll just be plus four. Bam. Ooh, it comes out. And you bam. Okay, so we're plus two. One. Two. This guy gets a wound from Thalen. And then we travel to the East Blight. Which is actually a good thing because it increases the time it takes us for it to get our board set up. But now we have to deal with this hill troll and we're actually at 
29.25, so we've got a little bit of time. Well, we don't, we've got one turn basically. So I'm going to attack with Thalen. Well, I'm not even going to bother attacking with Thalen because he's only got three attack and this guy has three defense. Okay, boom, and your blam. Basically got nothing we can do here. What I can do is go, nope, I can't really do anything. Well, that's not very cool. Let's go tap, tap, tap. Meanwhile, over this side of the world, what do I want to do here? Three, four, five. If I spend one resource, I'll place out this bloke here. Then we can start attacking into the staging area. Funny I put that up before. He can now attack for four into the staging area. And I'm also going to go one, two, and place out a blocker. And one, and place out another attacker. So we can now attack four. Three, six, nine, twelve. We need twelve to kill him. So we can now kill him. So I'm going to go quest, quest, add a resource to Thalen. And leave it like that. That gives us plus three. So I think I'm going to spend one and sneak attack Gandalf. And that'll give us another one, two, three, four, five threat reduction. And I'll tap him as well. Your blamo, we're plus seven, which is quite a lot. Let's draw. Boom. And your boom. Plus three. One, two, three. Okay, let's have the Hill Troll attack. I'm going to defend with the Wing Guardian. Give him a card. You blam! Oh, I love, I don't know why, but I love this card. I just love the art. Something about this card really appeals to me. I don't know why, but it's seriously one of my favorite cards in the whole of the game. Don't ask me why. And I hate it when I don't get to kill him. Oh well, into the discard pile he goes. He's attacking for six. He's defending at five. Now he has an ability that increases threat. So his threat goes up by one. Because when you're doing the the counting, it's four plus one because he's got one health. It's not just the defense that you've got to count. Because this ability says any spillover damage. Anyway, so his threat goes up by one. This guy is killed. So he's flipped over and added to this bloke, which increases his attack and his defense. So he is now three of each. Blammo. Which is pretty cool. And now we can go three, six, nine, twelve, because this guy's now three attack. And that has three defense. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Gives him nine wounds. So this guy's now dead. You bonk. And this guy flies over here. And both of these things are discarded because they both attacked, which is a good thing. That's what we want. So that's discarded, that's discarded. And we're going to add them as uh, cards to this guy. Which means he gets another two attack and another two defense. So he's now already at five. So things are looking up. And of course, this guy has to go back in the hand from the sneak attack. Sweet. Okay, let's refresh. 
Okay, bam, we're going to put one token here. I'm going to go one, two, and place out my uh, glow wine. I'm going to tap immediately and start digging for threat reduction. Okay, so still not a lot going on here. Quest, quest, quest. This side of the world, we're going to go one, two, three, and place out the support of the eagles. Bam. So now we've already got support of the eagles. We can only play it on our tactics hero, but we just drew our tactics song. So he's now attacking for three, plus five, plus one into the staging area. Okay, so let's go quest, quest, and add a resource here. And what does that give us? It gives us plus zero. So let's go tap, tap. It gives us plus four. Blamo, blamo. Draw two additional cards. Blamo, blamo. And that's an unfortunate plus two threat. Okay, we need some questing power ASAP. We're going to have a real issue if we don't get some questers out. Okay, here we go. We've got uh, Westward Traveller. Excellent. So let's go... What, uh, one, two. Place out the Westward Traveller. That gives us some questing power. And we're also going to use that to remove Gladian Fields and replace it with uh, this thing like so that'll get two thread out of the staging area because westward traveler allows you to swap the current location with one in the staging area let's tap him hope we get threat reduction or our northern tracker we don't but we are going to go one two place out another quester quest 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 Quest, quest. Move over this side of the world. We still have no real, nothing really to do here. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five. Place out this guy. We will drop our threat. One, two, three, four, five. And one, two. Place out another guardian. Should be noted that this guy is at 30 threat. That's not good. Okay, let's go quest, 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 and add a resource to Thalen. Okay, we're already plus five. It's not a great number, so let's tap you. We'll go plus seven. Ah, each player raises threat by the total threat of all cards in the staging area. That is plus 10, but we do have this thing, which is a creature. So any player may choose to discard from play one creature he controls to cancel. So bam, this guy is killed. And we get another attack and defense. And I think there's one more card to draw. And it is a Goblin. We're plus five though now. So that is one, two, three, four, five. But I will automatically take off one of those progress tokens because this guy's about to attack. Gladian Fields is finished and we are forced to travel to the Eastern Blight again. This guy comes down and attacks us. And I'm going to block with this bloke. Blip. Nothing. He gets one wound. Okay. This guy is discarded this time because he played him naturally. Okay. I'm going to go one, two, three. Place this dude out again.
quest, quest, add a resource to Thalen. And we're going to tap this guy, draw another card. We have our fetch. <laughs> quest, 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 quest. I'm not going to quest with you this time. We're still only plus three. God. We are having real questing problems at the moment. Blammo. Uh, roasted slowly does nothing. It just gets shuffled back into the deck. And we're plus two, excellent. So that is another one, two. This guy attacks, we defend with Denethor, it's automatically discarded. And we lose one progress token. Bam, let's keep going, oh, another Thingo card, let's tap you. Okay, so we're gonna go one, oop. we're gonna go one, two, place the tapper on Denethor, and I'm gonna go one, two, three, and place out the minstrel. Search my deck. And we're gonna grab Song of Wisdom. Now use that, place it on Frodo-ish person here. And now I'm gonna go quest, 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 quest. Over this side of the world. I'm gonna go, not a lot I can do here at all. I'm going to go quest, quest, and add a resource to Thalen. We are still bang dead even, so I'm going to add two more quest points. The plus four. Draw, draw. Ooh, and now we are in trouble. Okay, so we get one token is placed. Six progress, that's discarded. Now, here's the interesting thing. What does this thing say? Choose and ready one ally card, that's fine. So, we're gonna have to engage this bloke here and engage this bloke here. This guy has 30, 15, 20. So he gets a card, he gets a card, and he gets a card. Now tap this bloke. That makes this one go away. And he loses a progress token. Then I'm going to... Spend one resource and choose and ready one ally card. And I'm going to ready this guy and he's going to defend against this bloke oh wolf rider gets added that is horribly bad so he's destroyed now, what have i done here then i'm gonna discard this guy to ready a hero Oh, I did this wrong. I should have defended against the troll. Hang on. Yeah, so I would have defended against the troll. He ate the horse. So my threat goes up by four. One, two, three, four. Then I discard this guy and ready him i then tap him and defend against this bloke that's discarded and that's the situation okay then i attack with done here for three 
plus 12. So that kills this bloke. And then I attack, actually, I don't, do I need to do it with so much? Three plus six, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, I'd still need to, yeah. So, and then I attack again for three. And this guy has a wound on him, remember, from Thalen, and that kills him. Okay, we're really stuck for... One, two, three, four. Quest, quest, quest. Meanwhile, here we've got nothing. Let's tap you, draw a card. One, two, I'm going to place a U. Quest, 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 quest. Quest, quest, add a resource. He's the first player, so we can't. We'll add it to you then. We're plus four still. One. Okay, sacked. I'll deal with that in a sec. And Gladian Fields. That's plus one. Okay, sack goes to the first player. We'll stick it on this bloke here. And we'll travel to Oak and Grove. Wow, 37. We are stuffed at the moment. Okay, let's defend with Denethor. This is automatically discarded. Oops, wrong button. This is automatically discarded. And then we draw cards. Finally, we get a tracker. So that is one, two, three, four. We place out a tracker. We go one, two. We place out an iron miner. Gets rid of this. Yoink. And that's about that. So quest, quest, quest. I'm actually going to quest with this guy this time. Quest. I'm going to quest with you as well. That's just nine by himself. Now remember, we also get a resource on all these spots. That's one, 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 one. That only requires one resource, so it's discarded. Meanwhile, over this side, I'm going to spend one resource. Bam, everyone draws a card. Ah, we get a faint. Excellent. And you know what I might also do, what I should, probably should have done ages ago? Since I've got spare resources, I'm just going to spend one and put out Song of Battle. One, two, three, four. Okay, quest, 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 add quest. Bam, seven. So that's one, two, one, two, three, four. Oh dear, this is not going as well as my other game. Travel to Bee Pastures, which allows us to get Grimborn out of the discard pile. Be really handy to have him actually, because we're gonna it's gonna be hard for us not to have these guys attack. So let's uh defend against this bloke. That's automatically discarded by the brand. Defend against this bloke. Nothing happens. He's attacking for two, defending at one, so he gets one wound. Remember, this guy has one wound. We lose one progress token, which we desperately need to do because we've got a stall. We'll attack with Brand, kill this bloke, which will untap Denethor. 
and we get to scry. You bonk. Eh, return to top, whatever. We don't care. Boom. And boom. Still nothing. Quest to quest. We'll add a resource to himself. I'll go quest. Let me just do this over here first. I'm going to tap you and draw a card. Where's all our threat reduction, please? Still nothing. Okay, what have we got up here? Three, two, that'll be cleared. Okay, so I'm gonna go tap, tap, and that's gonna add one, two, three, four. This is cleared. Then I'm gonna go one, two, three, add another minstrel. Let's get a spirit song. It doesn't matter what song we get now because we've got all the songs we need. And then I'm going to go one, two, actually, no, I'm going to leave that up there just in case we get another thing. Oh, okay. So that's quest, quest, quest. It puts it as plus three. Plus five. Blam, blam. Plus two clears this. Let's uh, go back to the Anduin. This guy will attack us. We tap twice. Both of these are discarded. Tap with this guy, kill him. And that gives us a scry for one. Yeah, we'll leave that up. And I'm going to attack. Boom. That's just going to put nothing. So, yeah, we don't do that. Okay, blam. And you blam. We're at 40 threat. This is unbelievable. Where are all our things? So let's play one resource. We'll put this guy up here. I'll spend... One, two resource and place this one here. Quest, qu uh, quest, qu uh, quest, 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 quest. Tap this, draw a card. Nice. Okay, so we get one resource. A resource, a resource. This is cleared. This one is cleared. It is a field, so it goes in here. We are currently plus five already. Four progress tokens. I think I forgot to take one off from the troll attacking. Let's go blam. Everyone draws a card. You blam. Peak five. Get another one. You blam. Peak five. Nothing. Oh dear, this is really bad. Click, click, plus one. Seven. Blam. Remove all these progress tokens. Blam. Discard a creature. Gives us another another bunch of attack. We're 
actually plus seven now. So that is one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven. Six progress, we almost screwed up. Bam, that gets discarded because of the attack. This gets discarded. It is a Banks of the Anduin. Goes on the top. This guy gets to draw three cards. One, two, three. Finally. We've got no resources. Okay. And... We'll travel here. Boom. Okay, defend. Discarded. Boom. We're almost ready to try and win this game. We just got to get our threat down. We finally get the other tracker. But we're going to go one, two, three. Threat reduction. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm going to spend one resource and place out the Spirit Song on Denethor. Meanwhile, over here, let's spend one uh, one resource, place out another mark, gives him another attack. Okay, we've got two defend. So we're actually not doing too bad. We could probably win now. Let's go quest and quest. Uh, quest and quest, 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 quest. Let's double tap you. We've got plenty of of threat reduction now. Minus six, another minus six, yeah. So let's draw one card over here. Beautiful. And he's gonna tap that and add a resource to Thalen. That puts it as plus nine, which is way too high. Plus seven is probably too high even. Plus five. Blam, blam. Remove four progress tokens. It's five. That's plus four. That's one, two, three, four. This guy comes down and attacks us. Defend, defend. And attack, kill, scry. Uh, turn that to the bottom. Bam, and you blam. Okay, so that is one, two, three. Drop it another one, two, three, four, five, six. Quest, 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 and draw. Let's just finish this up. We're at seven. Over here, we'll go nothing. I think we can finish this game now. So that puts us at seven ahead. So I think I will, oh, I've got a quest with these guys, of course. One, uh, roasted slowly, there is nothing to roast. And two, we have a guy that's plus seven, which means we've passed this location. Bam. All these guys come out. And this guy becomes the active location. 
Okay, so these guys have three defense on everybody. One, two, three. And the first thing I'm going to do is discard Beyond to put one damage on everyone in the staging area. Why not? So it is one, two, three, four, five. This guy has a wound already because of the questing. So he's got two wounds now. So he has a wound, wound, wound. And a wound. This guy can attack for five into the staging area plus seven. So we can attack for 12 into the staging area. We only need 13 to kill, but they've all got a wound now, so that'll kill them. So let's go attack and tap. So that is five into the staging area plus seven, because he's attacking for 11, then he gets plus one for attacking in the staging area. So he's attacking for 12, three defense is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, minus three, which means that's nine wounds. These guys are 10 to kill. So he can put nine wounds on whoever he wants. So he taps once, and then he taps with Unexpected Courage, taps again. That's two sets of nine wounds, and we're going to kill Stuart. And we're going to kill Morris. Then I'm going to spend one resource and play out sneak attack and I'm going to sneak attack with descendant that's going to put another two wounds here and then this guy is going to attack I'm going to tap Denethor twice both of these are going to be discarded tap with that guy to kill this bloke and this guy attacks for one. Well, we can't kill that guy. Okay. Then this goes back into our hand at the end of the combat round, and that is another two wounds. Okay. Bam. Bam. Okay, so we didn't get our steward of Gondor, and I forgot to, when I did the Remember when I said it didn't matter what song we got? It did matter. I should have got a song of battle to play onto... Oh, I do have a song of battle on him. All right, so I've got tons of resources. Okay, so this is fine. One, two, three, four. We play him out. That's two wounds. We bounce him. That's two wounds. One, two, three, four. We play him out two wounds we bounce him that's another two wounds one two three four we play him out it's another two wounds we bounce him that's another two wounds one two three four we bounce him out. That's another two wounds. Okay, so what's that give us? We need five wounds here, so... Bam. Yonk. Eleven wounds. That kills him. And bam. And you bam. That's another nine wounds, so he's almost dead. And I'll just bounce him one more time with this one. You block, and he's dead as well. Okay, so 
that's that. Meanwhile, over this side of the world, we'll go one, two, three, four. Actually, no. One, two, three, four. We'll just go quest, 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 quest. Actually, we don't even need to do, oh, well, there you go. Okay. Uh, that gives us plus 10, one, two, six, seven. That's technically that's completed because there's no trolls in play. This guy will have him attack us. Defend, defend. Both of these are discarded. Attack, attack. They're both dead. Boom. And we travel to the banks. And that is the quest done yet again. We didn't have as good a run that time. Uh, I went through it really quickly. I just wanted to get it out of the way, see if I could do a clean run. Uh, we got a little bit of trouble with our locations, but apart from that, as always, Conflict of the Crack, pretty easy quest. And there were so many ways we could have won then. We had enough power on Descendant to just kill everybody, but we also had a double tap on Thorin, on Dun here, and he could kill anyone he wanted. And I didn't even use it, but... He had the resources to use his quick strike so he could have killed anytime he wanted. So it was pretty, real pretty safe. Okay, that's that. I'll see you guys next time. Let me know if you prefer these fast, quick ones. Like I'll do the, the nice, you know, lots of conversation and chat, but uh, for people who know how to play the game, quick games like that or quicker quicker going through it a lot faster like that might be more fun for people who know what they're doing anyway catch you later